Walking around downtown Buchanan, it's easy to feel enveloped in historic nostalgia. Older buildings mixed with more modern architecture blend the past with the present, giving this small town a unique visual landscape. In this documentary, we'll take a look at some of the lesser-known backstories behind a few of Main Street's notable historic structures. The Farnsworth Building was built around 1898 by Thomas J. Farnsworth and was first used as Levenstein's department store from 1900 to 1912. It has since been the home of the G.C. Murphy Company 5 and 10 cent store, as well as the Palace Furniture Company and the Center Restaurant and Tavern. Today, this building houses Bill's Bail Bonds and the law offices of Hinkle and Simmons. In 1908, Thomas L. Stockert built the Stockert Building that resides at 2533 East Main. The top floor of this building was originally used as the Arlington Hotel, while other businesses such as the People's Grocery, Shin and Sexton's Department Store, and Home Hardware occupied the first floor. Walking by this historic building today, you'll find local businesses such as Fat Tire Cycle, Lavish Boutique, Artistry on Main, and Anita's Flowers. The last stop on our historic journey is the ever-so-popular C.J. Maggie's Building. This structure, which was also built by the Stockard family, originally housed a bowling alley in the basement, while an assembly hall occupied the third floor. In 1940, Kroger's grocery store moved into this space before eventually relocating. G.C. Murphy's 5 and 10 cent store eventually took over in 1949, allowing them to expand from their previous shop in the Farnsworth Building. Today, the Stockard Building is known for housing C.J. Maggie's, a popular local restaurant run by the Rylands. Thank you for joining me on this brief journey through some of Main Street Buchanan's historic buildings. A big thank you to the members of the Upshur County Historical Society for helping make this project possible.